Howdy ho there, neighbors. Welcome back to another cryptocurrency news article. This one comes from The Block. And U.S. charges Chinese intelligence officers for bribing government employees with Bitcoin. <laughs> Very interesting. Uh, let's go over this article. The two Chinese intelligence officers were charged with obstruction of justice for bribing a U.S. government worker acting as a double agent. According to the U.S. Attorney's Office, the two officers... Shun He and Zhang Wan tried to recruit the government worker to steal files related to an ongoing federal criminal investigation and prosecution of a global telecommunications company based in the People's Republic of China, according to a statement released Monday. But in fact, that worker was acting under the control of the Federal Bureau of Investigation. The statement said the files were from the U.S. Attorney's Office from the Eastern District of New York. This was an eagerous attempt by PRC intelligence officers to shield a PRC-based company from accountability and to undermine the integrity of our judicial system. U.S. Attorney General Merrick Garland said in a press conference Monday, cell phone manufacturer uh, Huawei is likely the company in question. According to the Associated Press, when asked if that was the case, Assistant U.S. Attorney Alexander Solomon declined to comment. During the press conference, the government of China sought to interfere with the rights and freedoms of individuals in the United States and to undermine our judicial system that protects these rights. They did not succeed, Garland also said. He and Wan had been tasking the government worker for stealing confidential information about the case since 2019. In 2021, he paid around $41,000 in Bitcoin in return for a document that appeared to be classified as secret. The statement said then in October, he paid the government employee an additional $20,000 in Bitcoin. He was also charged with two counts of money laundering in relations to the bribe payment and faces up to 60 years in prison if found guilty, while Wang is looking up to 20 years. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Can you say your life is over? <laughs> that is so long. It goes by in a breeze because that's his time. <laughs> it just goes by fast the older you get, but... Woo, so many years. Yeah, crazy. Uh, I noticed this article was also on the justice.gov slash USAO documents. If you want to know more about that, it's all right here. The two Chinese intelligence officers charged with obstruction. Goes into a little bit more detail for that. The defendants, Go Shun He, also known as Dong He or Jackie He, funny name, <laughs> and Zhang Wang, also known as Zhen Wang. These guys are age 45 and 37, so oof, pretty crazy stuff. <laughs> I always like seeing these articles. It just throws a little difference in on like the adoption going around or this bridge just got hacked. Like This is a whole different article, and I love reading it. <laughs> so, yeah, what do you guys think? Let me know down below. Uh, do you think 20 years is too soon, too more? Do you like this article? Do you not? I'd love to hear your voices. So while you're down there, hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel, and until next time, the Crypto Sherpa is out.